Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, you gonna learn how to paint this beautiful dot mandala art on an old glass bottle. And it's going to be a step by step process. So without any further delay, let's get into the video. And before going into the video, if you are new to my channel, then please do subscribe and press the bell icon for more upcoming videos. So for this art today, I'm gonna use a medium size glass bottle. Then for the base coat, I am going to use white cement or else you can also use talcum powder. So I have taken one spoon of white cement. Then I am mixing black acrylic color and few drops of favicol. So mix it properly. As you can see here I am showing you the finish of this painting. After it dries, it gives a matte finish. Now I am applying it on the glass bottle as a base coat. The reason why I am mixing white cement is that if you directly paint the glass bottle with acrylic paints then there is a chance of chipping off the paint or the paint may not look uniform on the glass bottle. So for that reason I have mixed white cement into the acrylic paints. And if you don't have white cement you can also use talcum powder. So as you can see after the paint dries completely. It looks uniform and also it gives a matte finish to the bottle. Then here I am marking few reference lines for which I have taken a bottle cap and on it I have placed a pencil and marking the lines on the bottle. This way you will get perfect lines. So I can keep increasing the height by adding any kind of objects so that you can draw the lines for the entire bottle. Now let's start painting. So for the bottom line I am placing few deep yellow dots. And I am placing the dots close to each other. Then in between the previous dots, I am placing few orange color dots. For the next line, I am placing few tiny red dots. And if you notice by placing those reference lines, it has become very easy for placing the dots and also the dots looks uniform for the entire design. And guys if you don't have dotting tools or if you just want to try this art for the first time then you can also use other dotting tools like you can use toothpicks for very tiny dots. You can also use earbuds for medium sized dots and for bigger size of dots you can also use back side of a pencil which comes with an eraser. So this way you can use this type of tools for creating this dot painting. So do try it once. Next year I am placing few yellow dots by leaving some gaps in between the dots. So that later I am gonna place few mirrors in these spaces. So I am gonna repeat the same process of placing the dots for the entire bottle. And guys if you are enjoying the process then please don't forget to press the like button so that my videos will reach to more audience and it will also help me to grow my channel. So please press the like button. So we are almost to the end, here I am placing few yellow dots close to each other. Now we are done painting, so let's start sticking the mirrors. So I have taken different shapes of mirrors and you can take any shape of mirrors as per your design. 
So I am applying glue and sticking the mirrors as I am showing here. So keep placing them for the entire bottle. And if you want to buy these mirrors, I will also provide the link in the description box. Do check them out. Guys, if you still have any doubts regarding this dot mandala painting, then do let me know in the comment section. I'll definitely try to answer all your doubts. And also, you can watch my other videos. I have done 30 plus free dot painting lessons from beginners to advanced levels. I'll also provide the video links in the description box. Do check them out. That's it guys, here is the final look and it looks more beautiful after adding those mirrors. Well I hope you all loved this video and if you did then give it a big thumbs up and if you are not yet subscribed to my channel then please do subscribe and press the bell icon for more upcoming videos. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video, bye bye.